Abreed Tully. Uh, commitments made by the insurance industry that a reduction in insurance awards would see a reduction in insurance costs for the consumer are not being met. And in fact, many motorists and homeowners and business people are seeing their insurance premiums increase. When members of the insurance industry appeared before the Joint Committee on Finance, Public Expenditure and Reform, the call for the personal injury uh, guidelines was made with the commitment that a reduction in the level of claims would result in a reduction of the level of premiums. And with this in mind, the Oireachtas passed legislation and the personal injuries guidelines took legal effect on the 24th of April, replacing the book of quantum in determining the level of awards in personal injury cases. And the judiciary has subsequently reduced the awards in respect of these guidelines substantially. But on the day the new guidelines come into force, the director of the Alliance for Insurance Reform is quoted in the Irish Times as saying that they expected that insurance premium charges would or should be significantly reduced from the following Monday. However, since the personal injuries guidelines were adopted, the insurance industry has put the brakes on many of the commitments it made in terms of reducing insurance premiums. We are not seeing much evidence that the insurance industry is actually passing on these savings. Premiums have not been reduced for motorists, homeowners and business people in line with the reduction in awards. It seems that the insurance companies have simply pocketed the bulk of these reductions despite the commitments they gave. The guidelines since they have come into effect have seen a dramatic reduction in insurance awards, in some cases reducing the level of awards by over 50%. So we need a way to verify that these reductions in awards are passed on to consumers in the form of lower insurance prices. And the legislation before us today, introduced by my colleague Piers Doherty, will ensure that happens and it will provide much needed transparency with regards to this issue. And it will provide the Department of Finance with the ability to make regulations that will require insurance companies to provide information to the central bank on how the new personal injury guidelines have impacted on premiums for policyholders. It would force the insurance industry to pass the savings they make on to their customers. Similar regulations came into effect in Britain, where many insurers in this market also operate. Insurance companies here in Ireland shouldn't be the subject, should be subject to no less scrutiny. Consumers cannot afford to wait any longer, and the government cannot just sit back and hope the insurance company will do the right thing and reduce premiums. The insurance company needs to be held to account, and this legislation will allow this to happen. Gormagh.